Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you've ever been stumped trying to add special characters, like an accent, copyright symbol, or something unique to your design in Canva, you're definitely in the right place. Whether you're a small business owner working on eye-catching menus, social media graphics, or an Etsy shop banner, these little details can make your design stand out and look more professional. By the end of this quick and easy tutorial, you'll know exactly how to add those special characters in Canva, and you'll be able to give your next project that polished, creative touch. All right, let's jump right in. First things first, open Canva. If you're already signed in, you'll land on your home page. If not, just log in like you normally would. Now, once you're there, look for the big create a design button. This is usually right at the top of the screen. Go ahead and click it. Here, you'll type in what kind of design you want to make. For this example, let's type recipe. But honestly, you could pick anything here from flyers to social media posts or business cards. Typing recipe just helps Canva suggest the most relevant templates for what you're working on. You'll see a variety of beautiful templates pop up. Take a minute to scroll through and pick one that reflects the vibe you want, whether it's bright and bold, vintage-inspired, or super clean and minimalist. Remember, choosing the right template can save you a ton of time because the layout, color palette, and fonts are already set for you. Once you've found one you like, give it a click. Now here, where we get into the special character magic. Over on the left side, there's an apps section. Click on that, and in the search bar, type text character pro. This is a handy little tool built into Canva that gives you access to all those special symbols and characters. Don't worry if you've never used it before, it's super straightforward. With that open, head over and grab the text for your recipe or whatever content you're working with. You can simply copy it from a document or website. Now click into the text box on your Canva design and paste the recipe in. Take a moment here to read through it and decide where you want to insert your special character. Maybe you need a degree symbol for oven temperature or an accented E acute for a French word. Whatever you need, Text Character Pro will have it. Once you've picked your special character, all you have to do is click it and then paste it into your text box at the right spot. This part is actually kind of fun. It's like adding the final puzzle piece that makes your design feel complete. After you've finished editing your text, you'll want to blend it seamlessly into your template. Here's a pro tip. Click on the existing original text in your design, the one that came with the template. You'll see a little copy style option appear. It's usually in the toolbar above. Click that, then go back to your new edited text and click it. This instantly applies the same font, size, color, and effects, making everything look cohesive and professional. If things don't look quite right or you make a mistake, don't worry, just undo and try again. It might take a minute to get comfortable, but you'll have it down in no time. And there you have it. That's all it takes to add a special character in Canva using Text Character Pro and keep your design looking sharp and consistent. Thanks so much for watching. If this tutorial helped you out, please give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments if you have any questions or want to see more Canva tips. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more easy, practical tutorials just like this one. See you in the next video.